welcome to Cultural Hours. I'm your host, Linda Powers. Tonight on Cultural Hours... ...band, and chorus, theater programs are really dropping away in a lot of the country. The federal government now requires states to establish standards on, on what children should know and be able to do. A test-driven approach to school reform is squeezing the life out of schools. I think one of the wonderful things about education is that a single teacher can change a kid's life. Jay is a guy who took chances on, on certain kids, took risks with certain kids. I always consider Jay Jensen's class the center of the universe. I felt a lot of freedom and love and and safety in his class. This is my 50th year of teaching. He was a teacher around the clock, 24-7. The mom sits down and plays the piano and hears a little Chopin or Mozart, you know, or, or, or the father reads poetry. Most of us don't have that world, and you need an educator to come in and just open it up, and that's what Jay's all about. Wow, this is a dramatic approach to a theater. Here we go, upstairs to the right. It's really like being in a work, a museum. Class act. I'm your host, Linda Powers. We're at the Palm Beach International Arts Film Festival. And who are you? I'm Will Buckley, and I'm the uh, volunteer coordinator for the festival this year, the film festival. Um, I just saw Class Act. I've seen the film actually, but I can share with you the energy of the people coming out of the film. They wanted actually more information. They were looking for any kind of collateral additional information on the film. And there was a lot of excitement from the people coming out. So, And the other thing that was interesting was I heard a lot of people talking about it being a very special movie in terms of the message that it was presenting to the people. So, it sounds like it's one of those great little gems that we were lucky enough to get here at the festival this year. It's a story that is going to be excellent, very inspirational, class act, and I have the producers here. Hi, I'm Sarah Sackham, the director of Class Act. Other winters, class act. So, um, can you tell me a little bit about the film? Sure, the film's about uh, a high school drama teacher who went to New York to do high school in Miami, Florida. Thank you. 
he also uh, is a uh, spokesperson for them, and he goes to every event where people visit him. It's just, he is always on the movies, exhausting. He does not stop. Well, um, your mom, somebody's, whose mom did I meet? We are both of our moms. Oh, okay. <laughs> One of your moms, and she mentioned that you started it as a documentary about him. It seems like it's taken on its own life, and and I didn't expect to see the um, the celebrities that just surfaced through the film. I guess it wasn't very um, difficult getting them to participate because some of them were even in tears um, talking about the experience. Yeah, the, the film started out. Um, we wanted to honor Jay because so we decided to do research and we traveled around the country and began to realize that all of these programs were dropping away all over the country. And so we, we began to talk to a lot of the students who, as you said, are, are celebrities and, and very well known. And they are so passionate about how Jay changed their life that they want to do whatever they can for children in schools today. And I, I think you, I like how effectively you uh, read in um, social issues in the world, in our country, um, and edge teachers and for we have a lot of plans. <laughs> and do you have a website or some, something where people can see clips of it, um, anyone press related that can have access to? Um, sure. Um, the website is uh, www.classactthemovie.com. And you can go there, you can find out about upcoming screenings, you can watch the trailer, you can read all of our fabulous reviews, and um, you can get as much information as you like, and you can contact us directly. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, this is Linda Powers of Cultural Hours, and uh, we'll head to the next movie.